this is part of my Lagos story because this Lagos story would take a long time to tell. When I was uh, a young lad in primary school in the 1940s, Lagos, with a very small population, the population of Lagos City in 1952 was only 230,000 people. Any ceremony, wedding ceremony, by any family in Lagos in those days became a societal ceremony. Young boys and young girls will join in the Calabar Brass Band, which was the leading musical group. Lagos in those days, uh, apart from merriments, which I've just discussed, was very clean, very tidy. The environment was There used to be a flower show by the town council, organized by the town council. Flower competition, because houses in those days will have beautiful flowers in front of them. There used to be baby show, organized by the health department of Lagos Town Council. In those days, there were wole woles. If the sanitary inspector visits or visited your house in those days and found larvae in the drains inside the house, you would be fined by the authorities. The Lagos of my days, nobody dare kill a ram without permission, taking permits, written permits, printed permits. Uh, Lagos was very interesting uh, in those days, and we enjoyed it. Uh, the playing fields, after school hours, you go around. The social life also of young men uh, in Lagos, you had some uh, bands, and you have some sports where you could go and have fun at uh, Campus Square. I think that's uh, Cool Cats. Uh, I believe that Victor Laia started at uh, a Butimeta. Uh, there was uh, the popular one, another popular uh, place, where young men and women in the early 70s, 60s used to, uh, used to go. We used to go to it, yeah, the place at Idioro. I think that was uh, about the most popular joints uh, in those days. Well, the young persons, I think, enjoyed themselves. They liked, you know, Lagos life. You could fool around, enjoy yourselves all, all over Lagos. But uh, most houses at 8 p.m., before uh, what we call Agba, which was Agba from Akpapa, before Agba, do 8 o'clock every night, you will hear Gbam, firearms from uh, Akpapa. And by that time, you are expected to be behind your parents uh, does. Uh, that gives uh, a little bit of uh, idea of uh, of my Lagos, mostly in the 40s and 60s and early 60s. The responsible children work hard, play hard, but keep straight. Eko akete, idu 
That was my Lagos.